who wants to go thrifting at the Goodwill bins on this rainy day? All right, everybody's digging right here. They must have just restocked this wall. This is cute. There's a chip right there. Here's a cover for it. Oh, lots of chips on this. I think I'm gonna leave that here. It's missing an arm. Is. I thought it was a tea towel, but it's attached somehow and it looks like it has some stains on it. Y'all, how cute is this little piece? It's a cabin. Look the vintage greenery. Look the vintage Santa. Look the precious little puppy. Okay, it's adorable as is, right? But wait, look. It's actually a little coaster set. How cute is that? Definitely going in my cart. What are these? It looks like some little silver plated cups right here. Christmas items. It's like a little hook. Curtains. Gold frame. It's a little wood shelf. It was $3.99 at Goodwill. Actually, it is not wood, it's plastic. A wooden sign. Oh, what's this? Oh, candlestick. It has a lot of wax on it, but that could easily be cleaned up. It's originally from TJ Maxx, made in India. Let's see if I can find another one, but I like the details on it. Let's see what else is in this bin that had the candlestick. Oh wow, this is super heavy. Look at this ribbed glass angel. I love this. I'm looking it over to see if it has any chips. I don't see any and it's super heavy. Um, so I'm assuming it's good quality. We're gonna get this. Here's some china up here. It's a blue and white pattern. Lenox China Stone Country Blue. It's really pretty. They have these two little pieces right here and these little saucers, a little stack of them. I'm tempted to get these. They'd be cute little trinket trays. You could even put some floral in here. What are these right here? Uh, I don't know. It's washed off on the back. I think I'm going to put these in my cart and think about them. What y'all think about these? Let me know. So a bunch of lamps right here. I don't think I'm interested in any of those, but let's check out this locked tree. Oh, it's in a little pot. It's heavy. It does have lights on the tree, but that could be taken off. I think I'm gonna grab this. Okay, I kind of do like this lamp. Look at it. It's like a piece of pottery, kind of like a urn vase situation. It's actually a really pretty color. It's kind of like a mossy green with a little bit of white coming through. If I bought and sold lamps, I would definitely get this. I think it's really pretty. Look at all that texture right here. Do I need a lamp? We all know the answer to that. I do not need a lamp, but this one's really pretty. I just found this cute little tabletop easel. It folds up flat so I could store it. <laughs> but sometimes I like having easels because I love unfinished canvas art as well. I have a few of those in my house and I'm thinking, you know, on a shelf, if I wanted to put an unfinished canvas art, it'd be cute to have an easel. And I can distress this, paint it, make it look older. So I'm gonna keep it, it folds up flat so it'll be great to store until I have a place for it. Here's a cute little plate right here. It has lots of staining on it. It has, I think it's marked Lynchburg, Germany. That's adorable. We need that. Okay, let's check out this blue and white plate. A good mother makes a happy home. Mother's Day is coming up. This is adorable. It does have a date on it, 1975, but I feel like that's okay. 
what the back says a tribute to mothers that's so cute oh wait i think it says oh this says uh stafford i can never say that word y'all know that word right there england stafford stafford i don't know i should probably not say it right <laughs> all right these are good finds we're gonna get both of these found this little ribbed vase. I'm going to keep it for myself. It's from Pure One Imports, but I feel like when I'm staging, I always need a small little glass vase. So I'm going to keep that for myself. And then I found this. I haven't decided if I'm going to get it or not. It's a very thick, heavy ceramic piece. Mary Engelbert. I need to Google lens it and see. It's really cute for spring. Is it 100% my style? No but I might still get it. Ooh, y'all, look what I just found. Not just sofa legs, but giant sofa legs. Actually, I think I have some cloches at home that might fit on top of these. This is an awesome find. I Google lens this pot and I can find like her pieces pull up and they sell for a good bit for some reason I cannot find this particular pattern anywhere so I don't know if that's a good thing a bad thing but with the prices of you know what her other stuff is going for I feel like I should definitely get this check out this triangle purse right here i don't know about y'all but when i was in middle school the colored ones like this was all the rage oh i love these they're separated so somebody probably thought they were two separate pieces which you could use it that way but they actually go together like this i've sold them before and the customer that purchased it sent me a picture of it with a tea light in it and it was absolutely gorgeous so you could put something in here or you could use it as two little dishes this piece behind here is very pretty as well look at this uh, ribbed swirl texture I don't see any markings on it it is very heavy but I do not have good luck shipping big bowls like this so I think I'm gonna leave that one here and just take the smaller pieces all right guys I think I'm gonna head out I did end up getting the lamp I don't know something about it I just love maybe I'll find a spot for it maybe I won't but I'm just gonna hold on to it for now found this cute little blue and gray little shirt for me as well I thought that'd be cute to wear over the summer got some sweatpants for Brandon it actually still has the tags on it oh and I got a little softball mitt for Ren because Ryan's playing softball and she comes to all the practices so I figured well Ryan was practicing I could practice with Ren but today was a very very oh look I didn't even notice they put a new bright yellow line so when they refill the walls you have to stand behind this line but I guess it was fading so we got a fresh new yellow line at our good bins but today was a great day I got some really really good stuff oh I think I'm just gonna keep these bowls right here um they're so pretty look how good they look with wood I just love blue and white pottery so I'm going to put a total on the screen of everything um, of what I spent on this basket full of stuff today. I hope y'all enjoyed this thrifting adventure and I will see y'all in the next one.